All right, dudes. Um, oh, shit. All right, we're doing that. So uh, my name's John, this is my channel, and we're updating Starfield. We're actually going to play Starfield. Mm-hmm. We are. So, um... Where do we leave off in that? We satisfied some side quests. Um, I think we're... I'm trying to stick to the to the main quest line and not get too sidetracked, because... I think Starfield is going to go on for fucking ever if I do that. If I start doing more and more side quests, we're never going to get on the main quest line. So, uh, yeah. So we're going to try to stick to the main quest line. Haven't really been feeling myself the last two days. I got uh, uh, shingles vaccination or whatever the fuck that's called. Shingle shot. And... And a... Uh, Kind of knocked me out a bit. But, I mean, life goes on. So I feel I'm like uh, 60%, but you know what? 60% is fine. I went to work today. Went to work today, um, grabbed um, some things that I ordered. Um, a new... Uh, like a corduroy Sherpa a shirt snaps up. Really cool. Yeah, it's really cool. So I was very excited to get that. I got that, tried it on, fits like a glove. Got some shoes from there too. They fit great with socks on, without socks. So that's great. I like the color too. It'll go go well with the uh, shorts that I have. So, I mean, that was one of the reasons why I even went in today, was to get that, because I had that stuff shipped there to the office. So, so we got the chroma key sort of wigging out a little bit. You can see my, my shirt's fucked up, but you know what? Who cares? So I don't know if you guys like... Um, uh, in Boulders Gate 3, but I haven't really gotten many viewers uh, on Boulders Gate 3, so I think I'll shelve that for a little bit, concentrate on this. I think we're going to play, we might shelve Boulders Gate 3 entirely, and I'll play it off stream, or off channel, whatever you want to call it. And then uh, we'll play, um, uh, what is that called, uh, The Lies of P? I think that's what it's called. It looked pretty good. Kind of a Soulsy type thing. Uh, hack and slash. Uh, good action. Third person. I also think that Lords of the Whatever might be the same. So we'll play that too. Um, so just that you know, I haven't really gotten into... Um, I, obviously, I didn't get an Armored Core, right? I didn't get an armored core. I tried armored core. I really thought it was I was gonna like it. And um I don't know, we got to like episode eight of that. I got some good views on that. You guys seem to enjoy it, but I just wasn't feeling it at all. I was I was not sure where I was jumping. I didn't know how to stay up in the air. I I even looked some stuff up on how to do it. What I was doing was the right way to do it. You just needed to be better at it. Yeah, I'm not really interested in that. You know, I mean, I don't want a game just to be laid out in front of me and whatever to do, you know, but what the hell happened here? Sort of lost my TV. So, um, so yeah, so that's, that, that's what happened to Armored Core. Now, I might start playing that again if you guys think that that is something that we should do that you you guys would really enjoy it but at, at the moment um i don't really have uh a lot of people watching shit yet so i don't i'm not getting much feedback for that pause for a second because we seem to have a malfunction i'll be right back all right guys so um 
just restarted the Xbox. It, I it like wigged out after that update. It's fine. It's all fine. I don't think I've ever. Well, I think I'm. The only time the Xbox is, ever gets turned off is when I move it somewhere. So almost never gets turned off. And um, so I also uh, am not sure that we have audio. Be right back. And the audio is back. I swear, guys. So, um, okay, so there's a couple of things. And you know what? Maybe maybe I'm going to just turn this into a touch on topics and then start with the game in a minute. But I, I learned two things recently. Uh, the, very, the first thing that I learned is, remember when, when I discussed all that bullshit about... Uh, having HDMI 2.1 everywhere in order to get all of the features that our next-gen consoles can do. Well, that's great and all, but what, what, what ended up happening was in order for that to work, my capture card needs to be it too. So everything in the chain. And so for some strange-ass fucking reason, I'm like, didn't think of that, okay? I don't know why. For whatever reason, I didn't think of that. So I have the HD60X card, uh, capture card, two of them, one for... Okay, so that's another story. Anyway, um, so I thought, uh, I didn't think that it wouldn't do... So I wanted to do 1440... I don't know. Either 120 frames per second at 1080p or 1440 at 4K. I want to do that. I want to make it look better. Plus, there's like a bunch of shit that the Xbox and the PlayStation 5 do. I want that stuff too. Do I? Am I really going to notice it? Probably not. Are you guys going to notice it? Probably not. But you might, and I might. I just want. I just want it all to be maxed out. I just want it all to be maxed out. I mean, I bought the equipment for that. So if I know that it's not happening, I'm not a happy camper. All right. It's kind of loud, huh? If those bastards so much as leave a hand on you. No, no, nothing. Anyway. Um, all right, so that's the first thing. The second thing... Um, well, the first thing was the, the capture card isn't HDMI 2.1. And so evidently some just came out, something called, some a company ever something has one or is coming out with one. But I'm going to wait a while because I don't know if it's going to be, there's going to be problems with it or anything. So, I mean, that's one thing. I'd like it to be Elgato so everything is Elgato, but I'm not sold on all of the, you know. I'm not living in the Apple, like, you know, world, right? I have an iPhone. That's it. I mean, I do have a Mac for the, for the recording stuff. Only because when I was researching how to do all this shit, uh, people said the M2, M2, that's the processor in the Mac, uh, was really good. So, um, yeah. So I, I am having no problems with the Mac. The MacBook Pro... 16 inch with all kinds of other wing things. I did have a problem with the price. Yeah, that's $3,000 dudes. Fucking insane. It's that's insane. Anyway, so evidently I need to buy another one to stream. I mean, I'm not going to buy another one of them, but you know. I have to look all that shit up and figure out how to do that. Maybe somebody will fucking watch what I have to do. That'd be cool. Anyway, so so the okay so it was the capture card was one thing. They're not HDMI 2.1 compatible yet. At least the Elgato one isn't, and I don't have one that is. So all my HDMI 2.1 ranting, I don't get any of that shit because it, the card isn't. So it goes to the t it doesn't even go to the TV because it goes goes from the Xbox into the card and then out of the card into the TV. So it probably doesn't even do that. Fuck. Well, whatever. It will be, and we will get it, and it'll be cool. 
as well as it can be cool, as much as it can be cool. All right, so that's the first thing. Um, now, what was the, what was the, oh yeah, the other thing was the multiple capture cards and OBS. So I have this huge ass fucking dock. Well, it's not huge. I would show it to you, but I don't know how to fucking do that. Uh, one of these days I'll show you the setup. I wish people would do that. I wish people would show us, have a video. It doesn't have to be long on their YouTubes about their setup. Why they chose what they chose. I don't need links to their shit. I just want to know why they did what they did. I mean, when I was learning how to do this, because this is this is a hobby, okay? Um, I, I don't do... I don't do pretty much anything half-ass. Or I don't... That's the wrong way to phrase it. I don't do anything on a budget, generally. So you have to understand that when you get older and you don't have any children and you pay off your house, you're going to have more money. If you were responsible and mature with your spending ways then, and your significant other makes money and you make money and you end up with more dispensary cash. Uh, so you're able to do things like this. Which is fun. It's fun. It really is fun. Um, I'm not saying at all that doing anything differently is not fun. Like I have a lot of friends and family with children and they love, they love that whole, they have children, they feel fulfilled and bringing them up and all that. It wasn't for, it, it wasn't for my wife and I, we didn't, uh, we discussed it and we're, we just said no. So uh, we're a little a little about uh, doing more things for ourselves rather than others. Now you may think that that is um, whatever, but that that's the way we wanted to live. So we want to be able to, you know, buy this. I was I wanted to be able to buy like stuff like this and do things like this and you know uh, expand on my hobby and. Hopefully get you guys to watch it and you guys like it because, you know, I mean, that's the whole point. Well, not the whole point. I do enjoy doing it anyway. I'm going to fucking do it anyway. I should just record it, right? But in, in, in terms of life, like we're traveling, we travel, we, we don't have to really worry about anything in terms of like anything but our house, right? So we have cameras all over watching everything. We have a neighbor who will come over in the time of need if there ever is one. That's all we need. And then and then we can just go. We can go wherever. We go to New York. We go to New York for a weekend. We're like, it's Thursday. You want to go to New York? We go to Manhattan. We can go eat at Momofuku's. Okay. That's how that happens. And then we just go. So, um, run upstairs, pack. Throw some stuff in the old bag and head out. So it's a it's a different lifestyle, and to be perfectly honest, I'm not totally used to it because we're not totally there yet. I'm still working a lot. I, granted, I can work from almost anywhere, but but sometimes the work has keeps me here. And sometimes my wife, my wife's work keeps her here. So in that regard, pretty soon it won't be that way. So more of these spontaneous type trips and things will be happening. Um, it does happen on, on, on occasion. It doesn't happen nearly as much as I would like it to. New York's an hour away, man, by, by plane. Just go down there. We got our TSA pre-check or... Global entry, we got our global entry, right? That comes with TSA pre check. So you pay like, I don't know, our credit card pays for it. Uh, but it's like a hundred bucks for five years. And then they interview you. And then you can go through a line at, at the airport where you don't have to take your shoes off. You don't have to take your jacket off. You don't have to do anything. Throw your stuff on the conveyor belt goes through you grab it on the other side that's it so 
It also has a bunch of uh, another advantage in customs, which I don't remember when you're coming in from another country. But uh, basically, we go to Mexico a lot, so um, we we would we will be using that. So anyway, so what I'm trying to say is a lot of these things fit our lifestyle, and it isn't saying that any other lifestyle isn't as as cool or or whatever. It's just what we chose. It's it's what we chose to do, and uh, I I my sisters that have children they love them and they love bringing them up, and my mother loved taking care of them, and uh, my friends even the, my friends who bowl same thing. They have children. They they couldn't imagine it being any different. That's cool. You know? I have no problem with that. None at all. I mean, why would I? Right? It's their life. They can do what they want. So that's what they chose. This is what we chose. So I have the ability to do a few things. And because I have that ability, I, I like to dabble. And so I'm not going to if I re if I watch some YouTube videos about a about what kind of computer to get in order to do my recordings and they're like, man, you gotta get one of those new Apples, those new Macs. They're really good. And, and I'm like, okay, all right, I'm not just gonna buy it. Show me why. Right? And then I and then I do more investigation and do more investigation, do more investigation, because when you are interested in something that's what you do you kill it you look at it from every point of view everything so i'm not saying money is no object because obviously it is but 3k for a laptop is a lot of fucking money but i have nothing bad to say about it anyway so i get this big fucking doc right and i'll show that to you guys i'm going to do a video on my setup uh, it's not great. It's probably not optimized. I, you know, I, I just do my best. But I have two capture cards, one for the PlayStation 5 and one for the Xbox. And the reason why I did that is because I thought that I could be playing the game and then go, oh, okay, and then go up and take a break, come back down, sit down, queue up the other game, like say we're playing this game, and I want to then jump over to Diablo 4 and I have that on PlayStation. So I want to just, in OBS, uh, disable, 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 and then enable, enable, enable for the, the other HD60X and then have it just work. I mean, you can add the sources, but that isn't what happens. So I have, I put the source in there so that I, you add the source to OBS. What's going on here? Okay. You add the source to OBS, and then you, you can actually rename it. So I rename it like PlayStation 5. Um, dude, fuck. PlayStation 5 uh, game audio. Okay. All right, cool. And then pick the HD60X, do my little little tweaks and stuff with it, done. Now I got the other one. And by the way, when you hook them up, you open up OBS, they all say HD60X. They don't say HD60X1, HD60X2. You can't rename it right now that I can see. So anyway, and I have another one for my, my camera, so. I don't know why I fucking bought those, but I did. Anyway, anyway. Um, so I I go into OBS and I add another video source for my Xbox. I choose an HD60X and I see it pop up that the screen. So I'm like, okay, cool, I chose the right HD60X. Write a label Xbox game audio, whatever, game video, whatever. Okay, save it. Then I look, and it overwrote the PlayStation 1. Yeah. So that doesn't do it at all. It doesn't work at all. Not happy. 
So, my whole quest was so that I wouldn't have to get up and move cables. Pull the HDMI cable out, 2.1. Put the other one in. Come to find out, I can't do what I wanted to do. I wanted to have two so that I wouldn't have to fucking do that. Not that that's that big of a deal, but still. I don't want to do things manually if I don't have to. Now, take into consideration that I have to turn the light sources on. I have to turn the camera on. Right? I have to turn the, the TV on. I have to, have to change the input. So, I'm probably going to try to streamline all that when I get space. When we finally move. By the way... We did not win that bid. Somebody came in with, two people came in with cash offers. Just couldn't do it. Just didn't think it was worth it to do that. So there, there, there is, there's the ceiling for us. We're like, no, no. We're not, we're not paying cash for it. So anyway, so. Suffice this to say is that didn't work with the uh, HD60X cards, and I'm not happy about that. But, you know, I'm hopeful that this OBS software, I think, is open source or something, right? And and they, somebody does something and fixes that. That would be nice. If not, I'm going back to, I'm going down to one card. Especially if, um, if, like, Elgato comes out with a HDMI 2.1 card and it's good and there are no problems and it works with OBS and everything, I'll be switching to that immediately. You can bet on that. And if you guys want to buy my HD60X cards, I'll sell them to you, man. Cheap, half price. Just take them. I mean, they just sit here. And if I, if I, switch, if I switch cards, what would I need them for? I mean, that's just the way I am with stuff. It's like, okay, I get this. I get this thing. It's working great. Oh, there's a new one. I want the new one. Get the new one. What am I doing with the old one? Just sits there. Put it in a drawer. So if you guys want them, when I get it, I will certainly let you know I'll be making a touch on topics for that. For sure. HDMI 2.1. HDMI 2.1 HDMI capture card. When they actually get around to fucking doing it. Elgato is really elusive with that, as far as I know. I mean, everything that I've read on the internet about that is they're... You know, I mean, how could they not be working on it? They have to be working on that. Because the competition is going to surpass them. And then guess what? I'm not buying it. When they come out with theirs, I'm going to buy the other one. The other one's been out for longer. It's worked out the kinks. Worked out the bugs. Better. Things that are better. Anyway, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. I don't know what the fuck it was about. I mean, it, it is it is what it is. Uh, we're going to be... I'm going to be now... The wife is still at the Cairo, so I'm going to be playing a little Starfield here. Because I think Starfield... Okay, so I'm playing Diablo 4. Uh, Starfield. Um, uh, Boulder's Gate 3 and The Expanse. And by far... Well, by far, The Expanse is getting the most views. Because people are just watching that to see what happens. And I, I love The Expanse, but this last episode was meh. Okay? It was meh. Big time meh. Meaning it was just like, on a scale of 1 to 10, that was a 5. Okay? Like, it just wasn't that good. The other, the, the one before it was really good, but not, that one might have been a 7.5. The one before that was like an 8. But that was even better. The first one was really good too. So I'm really hoping the last one's really good. But anyway, so that gets, that seems to be getting a lot of views. I mean, a lot of views to me is like 50. Okay? I'm just saying, it's true. I'm just starting out. I don't have a, any, any, I have like 11 people. I have 11 uh, uh, subscribers. I could use some more su subscriptions. Please subscribe. 
Anyway. So I, I, po I posted a short of one of my friends that I bowl with who had a little camera on the front of his bike and he was riding on this trail on his bike with another guy that I bowl with who was in front of him. And his name is Brandon and the, and the other guy's name is Ryan and then Ryan's bike has got the camera. So Brandon's riding and he, there's a big like branch in the way. So he goes around the branch and he sort of loses his balance a little bit. <laughs> He topples head over his bike, like, and you have to understand that Brandon is 6'5", I think. Yeah. He goes right over the handlebars and, and you just, you just don't see him at all. You don't see him. He goes into the bushes, goes over his thing, and you don't see him or the bike or anything. All you hear is, I'm totally okay. It's funny. Anyway, so I posted that. It's got like 100 views already. It's got more views than like anything that I put up so far. So how do you know, right? How do you know? But of course that's a short, so that's easy for, you know, the ADD, the ADD kids, right? Uh, or or you know, they may not be officially ADD, but you know, the people who want the Instagrammers and all that shit who want stuff happening right away. Dude, man. I'll do a uh, touching on topics about when there was no internet, okay? Or a touching on topics about how does the internet get to Europe? Mm -hmm. Satellites, somewhat. How does that happen? Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I enjoyed making it. Please subscribe. And uh, we're about to make a, a video finally in Starfield. See you guys soon.